Oh gosh, no, not the Constrict. Well, let's see. I don't know if you'd live a Giga Drain, but now can you live a Bullet Seed? Now it's time to test my luck. I, I, I always do terribly with uh, Rock Blast. How do I do with Bullet Seed? A lot better, it seems. Holy crap! I've never hit four times with Rock Blast. First time using Bullet Seed, I hit four times. I'm a cheater. Scrambella, you're a cheater. Oh my gosh, Rourke is going to be mad at you. Rourke is has got to hate you right now. What a bitch! That's what he's thinking. It's okay, Rourke, don't worry. Scrambella uh, just has to make up for it because her other moves are lacking in PP. So she has to make up for a PP with a poo poo. Okay, yes. Back into Patrick we go. Patrice, almost. The way it's spelled. Alright, and back out we go. It's almost like Patrick's not doing anything. Man, I can only imagine. In Gen 6, I know they switched experience share and made it so that, you know, instead of, you know, helping one Pokemon, it just makes it so that every Pokemon gets the amount of experience the one Pokemon would have got. And I don't mean splits it between them. I mean, like, if the one Pokemon gets 150 experience, then everyone gets 150 experience. And it's dumb, and I I've said it's dumb, but it makes you think, like, how, like, how overleveled would you be at the end of the game if you did that? It'd be stupid. It'd be similar to doing, like, uh... A solo run, right? That's kind of what it would be like. At least as far as the experience you're getting. Thankfully though, I snapped out of confusion just in time to kill you. Sorry, for a while I was confused. Oh wow, and I created with one of them. Did I just hit- oh, I hit two times. thought it was three times. felt like three times, probably because of the crit. I was totally in the middle of saying something just now and I stopped. And it's gonna bug the crap out of me for the rest of this recording session. Did it say Tenna Cruel or Tenna Cool? Guess we're about to find out if he's cruel or cool. King K Cruel or King K Rule? And the answer is... It's Cruel! That's good. Tenna Cruels give out a lot of experience. But they're also really bulky, so it's probably going to eat up a lot of my bullet seeds. If only I had some Giga Drains. Oh well. I'm just that going to do? No, nothing at all. I think Bubble Beam is not much stronger than Bubble. But Bullet Seed's also pretty weak. Still though, in the hands of someone 13 levels higher, it should be decent. I guess for a multi-hit move, that's decent. When I constantly hit more than two times- OH MY GOD! Are you gonna hit four times again? Are you gonna hit five? Oh my god! You hit five times! Rourke is- is- Rourke is rolling over right now. He's rolling over in his grave that doesn't exist because he's still alive. That's how angry he is. He's he's building his grave by rolling super fiercely because he's that mad. He's like, just hurry up! Hurry up and let me dig this already because clearly I'm not good enough to friggin' multi-hit. Yeah. Don't you wish your multi-hit was good like mine? Oh my god. Oh my god, Rourke. I'm sorry, Rourke. I didn't mean to do this to you. Like, Rourke consistently hits two times. Scrambella seems to, on average, hit four times. Oh, God. What do we got? Staryu. Yeah, Staryu won't give nearly as much experience, but every bit helps. Let's do it. Let's dance. You don't want to dance? Do you want to dance with me? I remember uh, watching that clip on uh, Ray William Johnson who I think quit his show or something. I don't know, I never watched it anyways. I just saw the last episode of it because I knew he was a popular person. I saw the last episode or something and I watched it. But, uh, yeah, he was a person apparently. Hit two times, but that's all it needed to hit. Two times, like that one band in that one two-parter of Case Closed. It's funny because it's two parts and two times. And I'm almost certain that was uh, anime only. I would think, because if it was... Because they mentioned how the voice of the characters sounds similar. And, ah, oh, whoops, didn't mean to do that. Yeah, they mentioned how the voice of Conan sounds similar to the voice of, um... The, the one female in two times. 
And, you know, in, with the voice actors, I think they use the same voice actor. At least they do in English. They probably do in Japanese as well. And, um... And it never really comes up as a plot point. I thought it would come up as a plot point, but it didn't, which tells me that it was definitely an anime filler, because if it was in the manga, then they would have used that as a plot point, otherwise there would have been no point to it. So, that's how I know that was a filler, the two times. Mmm. Oh. Okay. I was trying to swallow something, but then it came out more. That's a weird feeling, isn't it? It was kind of some spit. I was trying to swallowing. I was trying to swallowing it, but it didn't swallow very well. So now I gotta swallow some water. Was I still fighting Axel that whole time? Are you this really the same Axel? I feel like I was fighting you for an eternity. Maybe I was. Maybe it's been an eternity. How much bullet seeds do you have left? 22. Um, okay. 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 I still have my uh, master palette, right? I'm gonna have to try and use that up before I go over to the next body of water. Okay. Let's try and be strategic here. Come on. Come on, bitch. Alright. I did it. It worked out. Sorry, Rourke. You'll have your day. All that bad luck will, will come back and do a turnabout at some point. I just love your ride. Can I have it if I win? No? You cannot have this. I I played so much in the damn casino to get this Dragonair. You don't even know. It was not easy. I mean, even after a while, even after I got good at it, it still, it still like, didn't become second nature. There was still challenge to it. Ugh. The idea that you want me to do that all again, get another one, that you can just have this one as a gift? You think it's Christmas? Well, it, it is pretty close to Christmas. Well, that doesn't matter. I'm not just going to give it to you just because you ask. You think that's how Christmas works? No. The gift of giving is about surprise. I'm supposed to give you something that you didn't expect to get, but you wanted all along that you didn't know about. Because that's how Christmas works. Because that's just a smart idea for a holiday. You know, it wouldn't be totally smart to just give the people money. I mean, they can get what they really want instead of, oh, I, this is what you really, really want. When really, it's not what they really, really want. But, but I mean, if you just exchange money forever, then it's like what Sheldon said in the Big Bang Theory. You know, it goes forever until, you know, you're all super old and one of you is just barely richer because the other one died. That was morbid. Not that I think of Christmas that way. The real way to think of Christmas is, hey, you get free gifts from your parents. This is until you get old enough, and then you really can't do that anymore. And you gotta start giving them stuff, too. Um, but, uh, yeah. Speaking of gifts... I think I was going somewhere with this, but uh, then I realized that's really personal, and I don't want to mention it. So, uh... uh segue! Um, I got my second ever 12 win arena run in Hearthstone the other night. And it was super fun. It was with Hunter, and oh my gosh, it was 12 and 1 too. Like, uh, uh, I my first arena uh, t t 12 win was uh, 12 and 2. That was with Shaman. Now I got 12 and 1, which means next time, next time I'm getting a 12 and 0. It's gonna happen. Um, so that was fun. I'm not fighting. God, I'm distracted when I talk. I suck at this let's play thing, right? Do do take my bullet seed. Uh, how many hits do I think this will take? Uh, four hits. Can I do it in three? Oh wow, he actually hit twice. She actually hit twice. Scrambella actually only hit twice. Can you believe it? Have I even ever seen that happen? Like, except when I was actually killing something. Has it ever only hit twice? I don't know. And I was right. It totally takes four hits. Well, I mean, there's mix max, min max stuff, but. Mixed man stuff, but that's how it worked out. Level 25! You're going so fast, Patrick. But so fast, I mean, God, you're taking forever! But you're fast enough. If you went any faster, people would probably complain that I'm overleveled! I would complain that I'm overleveled. I do complain that I'm overleveled. God, this Let's Play sucks. <laughs> oh. And if I don't like it, and my opinion's wrong all the time, then that must mean everyone else does like it, right? 
That's how reverse psychology works, I think. I just gotta self-loathe myself enough, and people will like me. I just... Bullet Seed! I'm glad that each hit of the Bullet Seed doesn't count as one use of the move. That would be pretty terrible. If that was the case, it would need like 100 PP or something. Does any move have that much PP? I'm trying to think if moves can even have that much. If like, if, even if you gave like moves like PP up things, if they would cap before they got that far. I don't know. I want to check. I want to check that. Does any move have 100 PP? That is something interesting to know. That'd be a fun fact to share at a party. Hey, did you know? Pokemon, um, the, the most PP that a Pokemon move can have is 66.9. Wink. Yeah. Let's get sexy with my Bulbasaur. Let's take my Onyx and your Cloister and go into the back room and we'll get giggity. Uh, by which I mean, we'll get, um, uh, the Giggity, the Pokemon that was introduced in Generation 7, um, and we will trade it to our other friend, um, Vagina. I, I don't know, I was going somewhere with that, and I should keep going, because as I talked about before, you need to salvage your jokes. If you abandon them, then who's gonna love them? If not you, who? I know, your audience. Of course, that kind of goes against the whole ideology that some comics have, you know. Yeah, yeah. What's the ideology? I don't know. You act like your jokes are bad, but then, you know, everyone else laughs at them anyway. Although, I act like my jokes are bad, but no one laughs at them. So, I think I, I get a win-win there. But even though I act like they're bad, I try to save them anyways. Because, you know, if you don't, like I've said, who will? Will you? Will the viewer? I don't think the viewer cares. Well, the viewer might care. But if they did, they'd like, comment, and subscribe! And clearly, since no one's doing that, they don't. I swim here with my friends. I'm tired. You know what I'm tired of? I'm tired of trying to make jokes, and then I get water in my eyes because I'm thinking they're funny, and I don't, I don't know why that happens, but sometimes it happens. It doesn't always happen, but when it does happen, I'm like, God damn it, why does that have to happen? It doesn't have to happen, but it is happening. I need to heal up my Scrambella before it dies a horrible death in some way when I'm not paying attention because I'm talking too much. Thankfully though, Swift won't do nearly enough to kill it. And still got plenty of bullet seeds left. Look at all this PP he has now! She! I'm sorry, Scrambella's a she. I just think of Exeter Heroes as he's. I will never live it down. But, uh, man. All the PP. So much more peeing he can do. She can do! I'm sorry! I mean, to be fair, if it was a he, he'd need to pee much more, but at least as a she, she shouldn't pee as much, but... but uh, or she pees slower, at least. I don't know. Is there a... Is there some kind of study? There probably is. That about if, if females or males pee more than each other, or less. I don't know. I don't know if there's some kind of ratio, or if it's about the same, or... Oh, I mean, I know it depends on someone on liquids you drink, but is there, like, a ratio, like, from liquid to pee, depending on the gender, or is it completely irrelevant? That is something I'm interested to know. As stupid as that is, I don't know. It's just, I like, I, I say that, but when I'm done this recording, I'm not going to look it up. Because, partially because I'll probably have forgotten, and also partially because it's kind of gross. I mean, if someone told me, like in a comment on this video, then I'd be like, oh cool, but I probably won't look it up. And I doubt anyone will tell me, because I doubt they'll look it up. Because let's be honest, who wants to look that up? Yuck. You just, the trick is, you gotta make your friend think they're going to, to YouTube, but mess with their link, so it actually takes them to, to some fucked up website that it tells them, and then they'll know, and you won't have to know, you'll just have copied the link, that, like, you saw the link, and so you took the link, and then they'll go to the link, and they'll find out, and then you'll know, because they'll be like, OH MY GOD, and then you'll be like, so that's what it was, and then they'll be like, HEY, DID YOU TRICK ME, and I'm like, NO. And then they're like, I think you tricked me. And then I'm like, I think, I don't think I've missed once with Bullet Seed. I mean, I, I mean, obviously it's hit multiple times, multiple times. But I mean, I don't think it's ever hit zero times yet. If it has, it's because I haven't been paying attention, which is very possible. Because Coney, let me tell you, I wasn't paying attention to you this whole battle. Coney, Coney, Coney Island. Um, I should probably heal up Scrambella. Let me reach into my bag of goodies. For a super potion 
to use on Scrambella, you can eat it with all three of your mouths, or at least two of them, because your third one's not open. Your third one isn't going to be hydrated very well if it keeps its mouth closed indefinitely. Okay. So, here's a, a battle plan. We're pretty short on, um... What? We're pretty... Uh, I, I was saying something. We're pretty short. I don't know where I was going that. I'm a pretty short person, by the way. And our, our, our characters seems to be pretty short. Uh, I think Rourke is a short Pokemon. HM Slave is definitely short. Patrick is short. A anyways. Uh, we still have the Max Chappelle going on. But, when we get over here... I think I know what I was going to say. Our Pokemon's level is pretty short, so we should switch it out. Or, I don't know, something stupid like that. Anyways, we're about 20 now, but I think the Max Repel is still going on, so we're not going to be able to catch anything yet. But I'm not going to bother taking, like, oh, hey, it wore off. Well then, time to catch something. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I was going to fish. I guess I could. Can you fish while you're surfing? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at its level! Have you looked at its level yet? I don't think you're looking at its level. Oh my god! It's level. It actually has a level that, that's higher than zero. Look at its level. I almost want to use this now in place of Krabby, just because it's level. It's already higher. Um, first I'll catch it though. Where are the Pokeballs? Chuck my Ultra Ball. I could probably hit it with one bullet seed and it would live, but then again, it could die, so I'm not gonna do that. Oh my god, it's level. Are you looking at its level right now? Are you looking at its level? Have you seen its level? I don't think you're looking at its level. Oh my god. Okay, Tentacool. Um, um. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my, OM, OMG, level. You don't even let, no, okay. OML, oh my level. Oh my, oh my, RNG god. Oh my, RNG Jesus. OM, RNG Jesus. Um, O-M-R-N, you know what, just to be less offensive, or more offensive, O-M-R-N, Jesus, 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 O-M-R-N, Jesus, that is the dumbest name I've ever made up, we're going with it, oh my, oh my R-N, Jesus, oh my R-N, Jesus, so the question is, do we go back now? Because I kind of want that tentacool. But crabby, but tentacool, 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 but crabby, but tentacool. Can I fly? Yeah, I can. I just leave him there to die. See ya, Dragonair, I don't need you anymore. Time to try out our RN Cheeses. The water's shallow here. There are many people swimming. Yeah, I've uh, I've looked at uh, RN Cheeses over. I, you know, looked at it's got the good of got the better of the abilities. Its stats seem to be good. Its abilities pretty good. I, I like it. Um, I guess we'll start by trying to actually fight with it. Let's use uh, acid. Shouldn't be resisted. Should do a decent chunk of damage. Oh, that's right. Shelter is kind of Wally, so it would Wally get it, so it would live. Hmm. Can I not switch train somehow? I wonder how soon all my RNG is gonna evolve. I get to add the switch train because it's a shelter. Normally I wouldn't, but it's a shelter. And shelters seem to have uh, really strong specialties, but not strong enough to. Oh, that's pretty strong. I was about to say not strong enough to stop my bullet seed, but you kind of just stop my bullet seed. 
Uncool, man. Uncool. At least you're dead now. With one time! That's all needed. Not even two times. Just one times. Oh, now the big times. How many bullet seeds is this gonna take? One bullet seeds. Two bullet seeds. Success! I actually just remembered that acid is, um, a physical move in this generation. I'm used to being special. It keeps getting to me. I'm like, oh, acid should be fine. I'm like, wait, it's physical defense? I guess Cloyster is both physically and specially defensive. I think that sounds about right. I kind of want to keep, uh, OMR and cheeses in front. Its attack is decent. And it gets the same type of attack bonus. It's not that strong of a move, but, uh... Should be able to do decently, I think. Can I give it any strong TMs? Let me actually check TMs real quick. Anything good in here that. Can it learn strength? No. Can it learn. Um. Good question. Maybe I should give it, um. Toxic. Can you learn Steel Wing? Well, I had to check. Fine, I'll just move along my merry way then. Trainer, fight me! Why, you're riding a Pokemon, can't you swim? No! What do you take me for? A grown up? Swimming is for chumps, Darren. I never even got the option to learn how to swim in this game. Because all, all, when people become the, of age, which in this game is 10, then instead of learning to swim, they just learn to use Pokemon, and the Pokemon do the swimming for them. If there was some kind of swimming classes I could take, I might, but there isn't as far as I'm aware. Hopefully Omar and Jesus evolves soon, and, you know, gets a good poison move, so we don't have to spend forever in these battles. Maybe OMG Orange Jesus should have already evolved. Maybe at 32 it'll reach the next evolution. It's possible. At least it seems like Acid's doing good enough against this chump. And yeah, I have clear body. Can't touch, just do doo 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 doo. Get a good amount of experience from that. Not a good enough amount, but a good amount. Just keep spamming the Acid Wave. Acid Wave, is that an actual move? Maybe in a later generation it is. I know there's like an acid wave-ish type move that's better than acid. At least I think it's better than acid. No, it's definitely better than acid. It's like 60 damage or something. I know Poison got a soup like, Poison, you know, was kind of the unloved type for a while, but it kind of got uh, buffed as the generations went on, except in Gen 2, where it got something that was immune to Poison. But, like, as the generations went on, it got better and better. Um, it got more moves, it actually got something else it's good against in Gen 6, but, uh, you yeah. know. Alright, another horsey fights the dust. What else do we got? Seedra! Oh crap, this thing might be tough. Let me try to beat it alone anyways, see how I do. How much is an acid gonna do? Ooh, not much. How much is a bubble gonna do on me? Uh, also not much. This might be a long battle. Wait. Let me look up what Wrap and Constrict do. That might be useful here because of how long this battle is likely going to be. Let's see. The foe is attacked with long tentacles of vine. The lower speed. A long body of vine. Two to five turns. Okay. I am going to wrap him. Because this battle will likely go on for a while. Wrap by OMR and Jesus. Water gun. Your attacks continue to be pathetic and weak. My attacks continue to be pathetic and weak. Whose weak and pathetic attacks will win first? Can Acid poison? I gotta check if Acid can even poison, I don't know. But my Acid, combined with my rap powers, should finish you off first. You silly Seedra. Aha! Crit! And I guess they can lower defense. But I don't think it can actually poison? Mm. 
I wonder if acid stays that way in the later games, that it can still lower defense? Because I know it becomes a special attack. I don't know. I'd be interesting to see. But you're dead, so thanks for playing. What do we got next? Another horsey. I can beat you with my acids. Don't need no wraps. Don't need a taco wrap. All I need is the meat inside. Just spam all the acids. Ever extend these videos far longer than they need to by fighting with Omar and Jesus, who were probably just gonna abandon anyways, right? Who was just gonna die? And it's, it's certainly possible, but hopefully not. Critical hit. Somehow super effective now. Instead of not very effective, you're dead. Oh no. A critical hit, if it was super effective, probably would kill me. Uh, maybe I'd live, but it would, it would be close. Well, at least I beat him. Ah, torpedo! What you just said. You got torpedoed. I think he said torpedoed instead of torpedo. I could be wrong, but I'm almost certain he said torpedoed. But, more importantly, is our super potions. Or fresh waters, which are right there. But I want to use up all the super potions because they're usable. And, of course, I also want to do before I, um, continue, is check if acid can poison. I don't think it can. But it would be neat to know. Acid, can you poison? The foe is sprayed with a harsh, hide melting acid that may lower defense. You know what would be better than wrap? Toxic. I'm gonna consider putting toxic in place of wrap. Um, like, just because I'm not sure what else it can really learn. Uh, I guess I'll find out later. But for now, let me continue on. Continue continuing on. Um, I'm just trying to understand everything. Okay, we're back in Route 19. This is Route 20. We're up here, and fight me! Seafoam is a quiet getaway. I I'm vacationing here. Wait, what? We're in the middle of the water. You're vacationing in the middle of the water? Is there an island nearby that you're talking about? Surely? Maybe just a dumb blonde. You do have blonde hair. I guess it's possible you are just a dumb blonde. Start by rapping. I think I'll be able to win this battle as well. Maybe not. Um, how much is that gonna do? Yeah, not enough. I should be able to win this battle, but I have to get off a rap. The rap is going to help a little bit, I think. Twister? Wait, what? That's not a water type move. Why do you have a dragon type move? You're not a dragon type, and you can't even become a dragon type in this game until post game for stupid reasons that are stupid and don't make sense. Thankfully, they fixed those problems in Hercules Soul Silver, and I'm certain, based on Mega Evolutions, that they're gonna fix them in uh, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. But uh, for some reason, this game they decided let's make it so nothing can be past what it should be. You know, basically just make it the exact same as the old game, but with updated graphics. It's pretty stupid. Um, but hey, still a fun game. The original game was fun. This game's fun. They actually did update more than the graphics, but uh, especially a lot of the glitches that were in the original game. But man, I'm getting close to dead. But my wrap with my acid, I should be able to kill this thing, and I think that'll get me a level up. And maybe I can evolve and stop sucking so much. I think. Come on, just beat this one guy. Almost certain it'll get me a level up. Let's do it. Let's do it. Beat him. Beat him. Beat her. It's actually her. You can do it, Omar and Jesus. Omar and Jesus. Omar and Jesus. Omar and Jesus. I was right. We got a level up. Now the the great question is: Should it already have evolved? Will it evolve at the end of the battle? I don't know. But uh, I'm gonna stop fighting things with you now. I'm gonna give Falconer some time to shine. Falconer hasn't done anything yet. Neither has Rourke, but uh, Rourke doesn't handle very well the game. Falconer would prefer to do some fighting. Use all of its wings to kill all the water Pokemon. Similar to how it flew me right off of my surfing Pokemon. And my Dragonair just had to like... It also had to fly its way back. It temporarily evolved into a Dragonair because it was so pissed but so wanting to be with me that it evolved into a dragon that flew over where I was, and then devolved, like Digimon style. Because all Pokemon secretly do have that ability, as we're finding out with Mega Evolutions. 
maybe not the in the way from second form to third form or first stage to second stage, but it's there. The ability exists, clearly. Your Seedra was strong against my um, Olarn Jesus, but it's not nearly as strong against Falconer. Falconer is gonna Falcon him with Falconry. And it's time for the moment of truth. Am I going to evolve? This would be nice and convenient. Thank you! Thank you for evolving! Oh, I thought he was at that stage. This is gonna make things a lot easier on him. He's gonna be a lot more defensive and a lot more offensive. I just hope I haven't, because of how high level he is, he hasn't missed out any good moves. That's my fear. Your Omar and Jesus has evolved into a tentacle! He hasn't learned any new moves though, unfortunately, but it is a tentacle now. That's a cool thing. Its stats are now higher. It looks pretty beastly. It's still low on PP on stuff, but that's okay. Um, should I use a super potion on it? I don't think I need to just yet. Um, let's see here. Can I get back there? No, of course not. Are there like hidden items? No, I don't think so. Okay. And we got this. You know, you, why do you have a little small getaway here if you can't, you know, fit into it and get through? What's the point of it? It's just there to get in everyone's way. Oh, am I at the end of the water path already? Oh, I want to get in there. Oh my gosh, I'm done. <laughs> Perfect timing! Bring it on! Strong chariots and water Pokemon are common sights in these parts. They say that Misty of the Cerulean Gym trains here. Oh, really? Really? She trains here? Have you seen her Pokemon's levels? Okay. Well, it's the theory from Pokemon Origins about them having separate Pokemon for each level of gym holds up, uh, which is really cool in my opinion. Then I guess it's possible. Seafoam Islands. Is this... Are we... Where are we? Give me the town map. Where's the town map? Where's the town map? God damn it! Oh, it's not even there. It's over here. Dirt. Is this a new place with new stuff? I think it is, but I actually have to go inside. I think right now I'm still on rep 20. Uh, so I can't get anything new or anything. Uh, there's a trainer there. I guess I'll go fight him. Um, yeah, I'll keep using Omar and Jesus. Omar and Jesus. Let's fight. I love floating with the fishes here among the waves. Oh, I love not doing that. I prefer to fight. I'm a fighter. Tiffany would like the battle. All right, Sea King. Well, I have plenty of acid uses left. Uh, well, at least enough. But you're high level. I should be able to survive a couple hits from whatever you have. Maybe I can kill you. Holy crap, if that was a crit, I'd be dead. Okay, run away, run away. Don't have pursuit. What kind of... What the heck kind of Sea King would have pursuit? I don't know, but I can't risk it. Actually, if it did have pursuit, then there would be no such thing as can or can't risk it. If it had pursuit, it would kill me. Bullet Sea Time! Man, my PP is low. Part of me wants to go back to the um, Poke Center and heal up, but I don't think... Uh, I don't think I'd allow it in my creed. It's like, you know, it's my rule that I have to, uh... Hey, Scrambella is the one who hits a lot with her, her multi-hit move. You don't get to do it. But, um... Yeah, my rule is I have to go all the way through an area before I can heal on a Pokemon Center. And I haven't gotten all the way through. I might actually leave Seafone Island for later. Um... Uh, that is to say, I'll avoid it, get all the way to the 7th gym area, and then come back. Once I've gotten all the way through. Youch! Anyways, okay, you're beaten. Um, I am gonna heal up my o Omar and Jesus because it's low on health. Actually, where am I supposed to go? Do I have to go into the cave? Can I not advance any other way? I'm looking around now. I might not be able to advance without going into the cave. Um. Well, you know what? Okay, the cave is a big deal, because it's got... Spoilers, I think this is where Articuno is. Let me go in. If I go in, I'll remember. I just need to see the entrance. 